10 English collocations with the word THINK from EspressoEnglish.net. THINK is a pretty common word in English, and we use it in a number of different expressions. Number 1. I personally think. Use this expression when you want to emphasize that this is your personal opinion. Other people might not share it. For example, a lot of students don't like that teacher, but I personally think he's brilliant. Number two, I honestly think. Use this phrase when you want to emphasize that this is what you truly think. It is your real opinion. You are not lying or modifying your words to make them more agreeable. For example, even though we've already spent a lot of time on this design, I honestly think it's not as good as it could be. Number three, I'm inclined to think, or I tend to think. Use these phrases when you have an opinion, but it's not an especially strong one. For example, I tend to think it would be better to travel in the spring, not the summer, since it won't be so hot. Number four, I'd hate to think. I shudder to think. These phrases are used for things that are bad, which you are thinking about, but you don't want them to be true. I shudder to think is stronger than I'd hate to think. For example, my salary is much higher than my boyfriend's. I'd hate to think he's just dating me for my money. I shudder to think what would happen if we started a nuclear war. Number five, can't think straight. If you can't think straight, it means your mind is very agitated or you are very distracted and you can't think in an organized way. For example, when the police officer started asking me questions, I was so nervous that I couldn't think straight. Number six, think carefully, think deeply, think long and hard. These expressions all mean giving a lot of thought to a topic, considering it carefully so that you fully understand it and you don't make any quick decisions. For example, I thought long and hard about leaving the job I'd had for 20 years, but ultimately it was the right decision. Number seven, think rationally or think logically. These mean to think in an organized and objective way without letting emotions affect your thoughts. For example, I know you absolutely love that apartment, but it's expensive and you need to think rationally about what you can afford. Number eight, think nothing of doing something. If you think nothing of doing something, it means that you consider that action normal and not unusual. For example, my sister is rich, so she thinks nothing of spending a thousand dollars on a purse. Number nine, think highly of someone. This means to respect and admire that person very much. For example, I think highly of athletes who are not only good at their sports, but who are also kind and generous people. Number 10, think twice. This means to hesitate because you are reconsidering whether or not it is a good idea. For example, hearing about the high crime rate made me think twice about buying a house in that neighborhood. If you want to improve your English but you don't have much time to study, you'd really enjoy my ebook, 1000 English Collocations in 10 Minutes a Day. Click on the link in the video or in the description to get this ebook. The lessons and quizzes are easy to finish fast and you'll learn a lot of English expressions.